Discovery can get messy. Can you see me? How about now? Crypsis is a fancy biology word telling us that an animal has a strategy to avoid being seen by other animals. Both predators and prey can use crypsis. I'm using cryptic coloration, also known as camouflage. This pattern on fabric is called camouflage. Hunters and other outdoors people wear camouflage so they can blend into the background in order to stay hidden from animals. This camouflage pattern also breaks up your outline or silhouette, making it difficult to tell at a distance where your body begins and ends. This frog uses a very simple form of camouflage. Its skin is greenish-brown, so it blends in with the mud and plants underwater. Similarly, this garter snake has long bands of yellow, green, and brown on its body so it can blend into the grasses. I was so surprised when I spotted it. This eastern cottontail is brown, so it can blend into almost anything on the forest floor. Sitting still doesn't hurt either, because our eyes are programmed to pay more attention to moving things. For instance, do you think you would be able to see this praying mantis if it weren't moving? The moving body and shaking leaves give its position away, but the mantis is so green and shaped like the stem of a plant that it would blend in perfectly when sitting still. This is an example of a predator using camouflage, just like the snake. This last one is really tricky. Can you see it? Katydids are members of the grasshopper family, and they are usually bright green and shaped like leaves. This katydid is doing a great job of camouflaging against these leaves. If you want to try your hand at camouflage, you can wear commercially available camouflage clothing or make your own by covering yourself in mud and leaves. Practicing your camouflage skills is definitely a great reason to go outside and get messy. Plus, imagine all of the cool animals you'll be able to see once you've blended into the background. Don't forget that you can follow Get Messy on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Thanks for hitting that subscribe button and then for liking and sharing this video with your friends and family. And as always, I'll see you next week.